Hi, greetings. Today we are discussing uh, t test no? on how to solve a problem or a t test problem using SPSS. So in this problem, so I will read. No? A study was conduct conducted to test the diastolic blood pressure readings between patients with sedentary lifestyles group A and those with exercise one hour at least two times per week or the group B <coughs> assuming a parametric method is employed so the null hypothesis here is there is no significant significant difference in the diastolic pressure readings between groups the sedentary and the exercise group okay so mapapansin natin this problem is a t-test problem no so in specific it is a two independent samples t-test so when we say uh, two independent sample t-test it is a parametric test for testing hypothesis about two independent groups so it uses means and standard deviations samples should be drawn from two normal populations and sample size should be large enough so that distribution of sample means is approxim approximately normal so kung yung sample size natin is small and markedly non-normal or there are outliers so other alternatives are the non-parametric test such as Wilcoxon test and the man Okay, so we will solve this one. Uh, first, is we open our uh, software, the SPSS. So, makita natin ganyan siya, no? So, there are two views, the data view and the variable view. No? So, sa data view, dito makita yung, dito natin i-encode yung kanyang mga parameters or given values so dito naman sa variable view dito tayo magsisimula so mapansin natin there are two columns so we have uh, the group A and the group B ok so pupunta tayo dito sa variable view we will type here the group so we type group So, mapansin nyo, mag-a-appear itong mga, mga ano na to, no? So, this is, the type is numeric. So, we will leave this as 8. So, since yung group natin, wala naman siyang decimals, so we convert this to 0. So, label. So, leave it blank. Sa values, mamaya na, no? <coughs> then, column is 8. Alignment, bahala na po kayo dito. So, measure as nominal. So, meron tayong tatlo dyan, no? But, group, hindi sa, uh, ano, no? Specific one is nominal. And then, role is input. So, papasin natin yung value. Sabi ko nga, babaguhin natin itong, ano. Uh, so, just click the, ano, no? Uh, anong ginawa natin at ulit? Yung tatlong um, dots na to, ikiklik mo siya. So, since there are two groups, we put here one. And then, yung first group is the group A. So, group A, which is the sedentary. So, click add. Yung second group, yung value niya is two. Then, group 2 is named uh, group B. <coughs> the exercise. Okay. So, click, just click add. And then, uh, click OK. Ayan. So, kung i-check natin siya dito. Ayan. Mapansin natin sa data view, meron na siyang label yung kanyang first column <coughs> as group ok, ano pa ang kailangan natin so the 
values sa uh, diastolic values diastolic blood pressure so we have uh, the variable diastolic bilangin nyo yan, that is 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and then 10 din dito. Kaya 20 yung ating row. So, yung sa group, sabi nga natin, ginawa natin yung group A as 1. So, lalagyan natin dito. These are all ones hanggang 10. And then, doon sa group B, di ba nilagay natin kanina dito sa variable view no? na yung group B is 2 uh, uh,
statistics viewer ng tites kasi natin ito yung group statistics so yan, makita natin yung mean and the standard deviation, the standard error of the mean and then ito yung importante dyan so we use equal variances because yung kanyang F statistic is greater than 0 0.05 so we use equal variances and kung titingnan natin sa ano nito, ano, sa sa kanyang uh, p value which is 0 0.026 it is uh, less than 0 0.05 meaning that there is a significant difference in the diastolic blood pressure readings between groups because yung p value nya p value nitong ano na to uh, nitong row na to is less than 0.05 Okay. So, it, furthermore, makita natin yung independent sample effect sizes. Yan, mga yan. Okay. Thank you very much. Hope you have learned from this lesson. And don't forget to subscribe to Sir Bren. And I will see you on the next video. Have a good day. Thank you very much.